Hello there, Gina Wieselman here of MySweetPaper.com, and today I'm excited to share some information with you about FlexPoints. To start with, I'll show you how to navigate to your FlexPoint account. So from the Stampin' Up! website, you will want to click Demonstrator Login, enter your demo ID and password, and log in. From here, you can find your flex points by clicking Ordering and My Flex Account. Now, once you're within this page, you can see your flex point balance, and this is the number of points that you have that you're able to spend. So the reason I'm sharing this video now is because the flex points you currently have are only good until October 31st. So it's really important that you spend these points and get some free items if you're able to uh, before the points expire. So I'm going to walk through the way that I'm going to make use of my points. First, I'll highlight a few key items that are available for sale with flex points. Two of my favorites, of course, are the CSV product credits because that amounts to free stuff for you. You can also buy packages of holiday catalogs, regular catalogs, some fun Stampin' Up! gear. There's more of that. And then we get into some title items. For example, the silver title money clip and the silver title necklace are only available for purchase with points for those people who are silver title or above. Since I am currently a silver title, I could add this to my cart and redeem my points. However, since I'm not a gold, you can see the title restriction here won't allow me to select the gold items. There's platinum items as well, and my dream, the incentive trip. You'll notice this takes 160,000 points, and clearly I'm not there yet. So maybe if I keep working hard, someday I can redeem my flex points for a free, all-inclusive trip, um, which includes bringing a guest and seems absolutely amazing. Something that is new right now, Stampin' Up! is offering a $5 coupon code that costs 700 points. Each demonstrator can purchase up to three of these coupon codes, and the interesting thing about them is that they're giftable. So you'll get an actual coupon code, and you can share that with anyone that you would like to give a gift to. Of course, you can also use it yourself. The gift cards here are available as well, if that's something that you would like to spend your points on. And then at the bottom, if you're lucky enough to go on the incentive trip and you still have extra flex points after that, well, you can get some cash allowance for your, your travels. Again, I'm of course not able to do that. So looking at my 24,196 points, the first thing I know I want is a $100 product credit. The nice thing is as it adds to my cart, it subtracts from my points available. So I can see right now that I don't have enough to add another 100 CSV product credit to my cart. I do have enough for a 40 CSV product credit, so I'm going to add one of those as well. And look at that, I'm at 6,196 points. I could go ahead and spend my points on some other items here. These reusable shopping bags just look so cute. Um, but I actually just want more free stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and add another one to my cart. And now we see that I have two in the cart and I'm down to 696 points. So I'm just going to change the sorting mechanism from default to sorting by points. And I can see here that the $5 coupon code is the lowest point item and requires 700 points. And unfortunately, I am just shy. So not a big deal, but I'm going to now complete this purchase. So I'll go to my cart. 
I can confirm that I have two of the 40 CSV product credits and one of the 100 CSV product credits. It has all of my information, um, the total number of points that I'm using and how many I have left, and I press submit. The order has been placed and I'll have a confirmation email. One important thing, these orders are not able to be canceled or refunded in any way. So make sure that you've really settled on the item or items that you want before you proceed through and finalize your order. When I want to use my CSV product credits, all I have to do is go into my demonstrator account and place a demonstrator order. Once I add enough items to reach the 40 CSV value level or the 100 CSV level or beyond, I'll start to see those codes show up and all I have to do is check and confirm that I want to use that product credit on that particular demonstrator order. Now you might be wondering, how can I get more of these points? Because free stuff is amazing. And I'm going to go back to my home page after I've logged in as a demonstrator, and I'm going to go to business resources. The compensation plan is where I can find more details about flex points. There's a bunch of resources here, but I'm going to go right to the main compensation plan document. This opens up as a PDF. I could download this to my computer, but I am going to look in the table of contents for flex account and jump ahead to that page. This document will give you a lot more detail about how you can earn flex points. And basically you can earn points for a variety of reasons. You earn points for every dollar in sales you make, you earn points each time you recruit a new person to join your Stampin' Up! team. You earn points for leadership if you yourself advance to the next title or if someone on your team advances to the next title as well. For people who are new demonstrators, you can earn flex points for the Quick Start program, which means if you sell 900 CSV, within your first three full months as a demonstrator, you get 5,000 flex points. And if you sell 1,800 CSV in your first six months, you earn 10,000. You also earn flex points on your Stampin' Up! anniversary. So I just had my five year anniversary this, this year, which gave me a wonderful 5,000 bonus flex points, which as we saw on the redemption page, that's almost a 40 CSV reward. As you scroll down the document, you can get a lot more information about the specifics for each way to earn, including your quick start elig eligibility period based on when you signed up as a demonstrator. So there's a lot more information here. I'll leave you to explore that but please let me know if you have any questions.